checking the temperature of the vapor line, suction line here, with my field piece SC440. And we've got 50 degrees, 49, 48 degrees. Oh, wait, 47 degrees. That's pretty good. Suction pressure is 125. Okay, it's in cooling operation. 46. So we had 51 coming out of the supply. So the vapor temperature, the temperature of this vapor line that's leading into our EVAP is 46 degrees. And then when it comes out of the supply vent, it's 51. We got our fitting to be able to hook up our low side gauge. There is no port for the high side. Make sure those flares are nice and tight. Any pressure tests above 580. Make sure you don't get the F1 and F2 mixed up from the inside to outside. Make sure that you ground it at the outdoor unit for the communication. Just a few tips. And always factory charge. Always factory charge. 88 ounces. So divide that by 16, you'll have the pounds. Always push K1 after you start this equipment up. F3 is to reset. You can also test cooling and test heating operation through the K switches. All right. 